All right, this time the College World Series will already be underway. It's one of those events that goes beyond the box score. Yeah, our Brent Weber spent the day with fans and joins us live from the ballpark now. Hey, Brent. Guys, this is uh, this is where it starts for many of the thousands who will come by. I was about to say this is a rarity. There's not anyone standing right in front of the Road to Omaha statue, but uh, soon there will be. This is at the corner, of course, of Cumming and 13th Street. It is the go-to for many folks, this uh, is the place where the first thing they'll do is stand in front of it and take a snapshot. It's a history thing, right? It, it's a big deal to be here. It, it's uh, it's off the bucket list. It's, it's important. It's uh, something that if you grew up around baseball, you've known about it. And when it was at the old stadium, now it's here downtown. It's it's something that I want him to enjoy too. You know, it's something that he's getting ready to go into high school, and so we figure it's got you got to do it now so you can take it all in and get the whole experience. I like to have that memory from like let's say I get older. I would like to look back at that, and this is like a big deal to me and stuff because baseball is my life. Baseball is life. That is the motto for the next uh, 10 days. Local sculptor John Lige, but this is his baby. He's the creator of the Road to Omaha statue. Of course, it moved here in 2011, and it is polished up, and it's beautiful. And i got to tell you, I get chills, too, uh, no matter how many times you come out here knowing what it represents. We'll have some more stuff from around the stadium, and uh, it is going to be baseball in action tomorrow. <laughs> Sports will have a look at practice and uh, maybe they get all the jitters out there, but I'm going to keep my jitters until the games begin. Guys? All right, Brent, yeah, as you mentioned, the opening game uh, tomorrow features Oral Roberts and TCU. The nightcap should be a great pitcher's duel, Virginia and Florida. Joe Nugent and Grace Boyles are live at Charles Schwab Field with an in-depth look at some very exciting first-round matchups. Hey, guys. Hey, how you doing? You, we cannot wait. For, uh, for the games tomorrow. I mean, it is it's going to be awesome. Great atmosphere here around the ballpark. It's just all building with the anticipation. We have great teams here, and we have great players as well. Oh, yeah, anyone who comes down to Charles Schwab this week is going to have a star-studded weekend week with a lot of MLB prospects, especially with LSU, who just finished up here, having the number one potentially draft pick in the MLB draft this year with Dylan Cruz, the outfielder. He just finished up. Make sure to come out and see him in a plenty of other ones. Year in and year out, you have future first round picks, but this year we have a ton of them. We're talking a dozen or possibly more, and it's going to be a treat for them to all play against each other here in Omaha. It's awesome. I mean, we're here at the College World Series, so it's the best baseball players in the country and the best teams in the country. So having all that in one spot is really cool. It's an honor to be a great ball player here, and and um, as far as the draft's concerned, I'm, I'm just focused on being here and winning ball games with the team and um, trying to win a national championship. It's kind of cool because everyone kind of knows each other. So I mean, we kind of just, we all hang out and when we do, we also don't even really talk about baseball. Um, it's kind of just our, our little getaway, just talk about whatever. Playing with these guys, playing against guys, you know, that, that are projected really high and uh, just have a lot of talent. So, um, I mean, it's, it's part of college baseball and it's part of playing in the World Series and, you know, there's going to be the best talent in the, in the country. I think it's outstanding that there's, you know, tons of good teams, tons of good players here. Um, but I, what I'm really just more looking forward to is just seeing how we go out there and compete, you know, play our baseball, play our good, good team baseball. And, you know, I'm just really excited to be out there. It was interesting because several players echoed what Braden just said. Didn't really want to talk about himself or themselves. Like, hey, man, we're in Omaha. We're here to win a national title. Or the opponents. They don't really want to talk about the opponents and their star-studded rosters either. However, they're ready for the action this weekend. That begins tomorrow at 1 o'clock. Can't wait. It's going to be a good one. Oral Roberts taking on TCU. We'll see you here later with more. Yeah, exciting times for sure. Thank you, guys. And, of course, we do have much more coverage of the College World Series online, WWT.com. You'll find tips on getting around Charles Schwab Field as well as the changes to the concession lineup this year. You can also take a look at the stadium's clear bag policy and tailgate rules. Plus, there's links to the bracket and schedule of games. It's all the information you need for the CWS on WWT.com.